Hey loves and welcome back. It is good to have you on here again. So this is another hair review video and in this video we're going to be unboxing, installing, styling and reviewing this week right here from Jessie's week and this is what it looks like. Okay, so now that we've seen what this hair looks like, I'm gonna show you how this hair came. And this is the box that this hair came in. This hair is from Jessie's Week again. And this is what we get. We get this elastic band. We have this pair of lashes. We have this beauty blender. We have a HD Week cap. And we have this brush set, guys. Again, you do get this guide as well. And yeah, this is the week that we're going to be reviewing, guys. This one came in 24 inches. And I want you guys to have a look at the lace. Look at the lace. Look at the knots. Again, because it is like a blonde weave, the knots are a bit bleached. But this is what the highlight looks like. I want you guys to get into it. Because if Beyonce was a week, this probably would be her. <laughs> but yeah, this is it. We do have different shades. And this is the construction of the week, guys. You do get about 2 inches worth of parting space on the sides. You get wig combs as well as elastic band for that extra security but this is what the balayage honey brown wig looks like and this is their balayage honey brown layered cut frontal lace wig and this is what it looks like again it's giving me like i don't know it's giving me beyonce vibe <laughs> If Beyonce wear a wig, this is some. This is kind of what she would look like. But we're gonna be putting this on and installing this and showing you guys exactly what it looks like. So starting up with my hair weaved back, I'm gonna use this HD wig cap that it came with just to kind of get my hair out of the way, right? So just let me put this on so you guys can see. But before I do that, I'm gonna go ahead to cut off this excess lace at the back because i don't think we're not going to be using this for anything just cut this off so we don't forget to do it okay so i'm gonna just put this on and show you guys exactly what it looks like straight out of the box i like to adjust the band so that way when i put it on it feels tight and snug so somewhere around here and again you can always readjust it if you have to so then just put this on mm, perfect i love how tight it is like i love how tight it is let me just adjust this oh so this came already pre-styled and it came in in a style side part luckily this is how this is where i like my part to be so we're going to be using this if you're someone who wants like a center part you can always go back to readjust it okay mm, i feel like i might go in deeper with the side part <laughs> okay so this is what it looks like straight out of the box right this is what the lace looks like um this is what the hair looks like this is the texture this is the color and this is the length as well beyonce beyonce oh mm -mm. i am not mad at it at all so what i want to do first of all is to go ahead to to cut off the excess lace i'm going to be using this tiny scissors to do that so i realized that anytime i like reinstall my lace it's always easier for me and that's because i've already cut off the excess lace so let me just cut this off so that way we can have a seamless and faster install if this is your first time doing this you do want to take your time but you also want to make sure that you're not cutting off the hair as well so we've done one side and it looks good right i'm going to do the other side don't know if you guys are seeing this but i'm trying to cut like i'm trying to make the cut like really jagged and snip i'm gonna cut off the excess lace from around the ear side so that way it lays flat off okay all 
Okay, so what I want to do now is to match the lace to my forehead so that way when I melt it down everything just blends into my skin I'm gonna be using this powder this is what I use in contouring my forehead so let me put this back onto my head take it back now I don't know if you guys can see this but can you see that like it's already looking good Okay, so next up, I'm just going to use the Ebon Wonder Spray. I'm going to be using this to help melt this lace and to get it looking right. Um, just to push it back up. While the lace is melting, I'm going to be using my hairband just to help further melt it down. I'm going to be using this and use that to help melt the lace. This is going to be like my first melt. Okay, I like where this part is at. I'm going to be using my hair wax to just help tame this so that way we can use our hot comb to melt it down. Just a little bit because I don't want this to be greasy. To help define the part, I'm going to be using my concealer shade. This one is from Ellie Girl and my brush as well, a very precise brush. Just taking a little bit of that, of the concealer, dusting it off because we don't need a lot. We just want to help define this part. I'm gonna take this out and do melt. I think I don't know if I want to do like some baby hair. So this wig did come straight. It came in as a straight wig. However, you can style this wig however you want to style it. You can do like a straight style. You can curl it up. You could you know do a center part, do a side part. However, you know you want to style it. Do you? However, I want to kind of play around with baby hair, guys. I am not a baby hair kind of girl, but listen, I don't know. I had this feeling that it would look really nice on this hair with this color. So I went ahead to do it, right? Now, I don't know how to do baby hair. I'm still learning. So I'm just figuring out where I need to cut, how I need to cut it and how I need to like you know swoop it up <laughs> just so we can get like that beautiful baby swoop now i'm not really a fan of baby hair like i said because sometimes i find that it is it looks too overpowering it looks too unrealistic so if you notice i'm just taking a couple of hair strands maybe about 10 hair strands very light very you know light-handed with this because i don't want that bulky um you know baby hair look i just want it to look really soft and natural just a couple of hair strands and this is how i would rock it now i'm gonna help with my serum 
just add shine to give this unit some love because again this is a highlight BM unit so it's been through a lot in terms of processing so adding a little bit of serum just to add shine bring the life back and you know also going in with this my ebon spray I want to do like a double melt and for this I want to be very specific with where I'm applying that glue now if you do have any lifting you do want to be precise with where you're applying it and how you're applying it so I'm just applying that glue onto the tips of the lace so that way it could lay flat and it could blend into my skin right so that's what I'm doing right now I usually wait for this to be almost like 90% dry down and then I go ahead to use my comb to press it down and then I use my ban to melt it down like I'm doing right now so I'm just melting this down so that way it will look like skin now this is a layered wig it did come layered like you're seeing right now however I'm going ahead to kind of create my own layers right I want to emphasize on the layers especially in the front and i'm going ahead to swoop it up a little bit more I'm also cutting the other side of the hair just so both sides kind of look even right now at this point i'm kind of feeling the little curls that i did and i figured you know i might as well just curl the front of this wig just to add volume to it and to add texture to it and this is what it's looking like i definitely prefer this unit curled up like this what do you guys think do you prefer it straight or do you prefer it curly like it is looking right now now i'm definitely loving how it is looking how it is falling and i figured you know let me just go ahead to curl this even further and i want to curl the rest of the hair so i'm just curling the tips of the hair just to add volume and you guys will see that it's, it just looks gorgeous right like it's giving like effortless curls but it's still there so i'm curling the rest of the the tip of the hair and i just want it to fall beautifully like it is doing right now gorgeous so yeah i'm just gonna spend a couple of minutes curling this hair like i said you can curl it you can style it however you like and i'm also going to style and curl the bangs in front right here guys when i tell you this looks so beautiful believe me it looks so beautiful i don't know if it's the highlight or if it's the hair or if it's the melt but look at that look at look at that bang oof yeah so i'm gonna just finger comb this and guys look at this this right here is the finished look what do you guys think about this hair would you rock it yeah thank you so much jesse's week for sending me this gorgeous unit all the this all the details about this unit will be in the description box be sure to check them out and yeah look at that nails guys look at the hair look at the texture look at the blend i i love this <laughs> it's giving me give me a name down in the comment section and i'll see you guys in the next one till then make sure you see fabulous kisses bye guys